into it. And that's what we're going to do right here, Nickel. We're going to smoke some bud, man. And up first, guys, we're going to check out the Gorilla Zittles. So check this out. That bud is looking redonkulous, Nickel, man. This, this bud has really blown my mind. You must have sent me... Every single bud was the size of my hands. We've got one rolled up in a joint, man. Tell us a bit about how the grow went with this Gorilla Zittles and kind of what you know about it on your end. I'm going to light this thing up. Yeah, so the, I grew, um, I, I pretty much did the same for all three of those strains. At the time when I was growing them, I mean, those were testers again. So I like, I had no idea what I was, what I was growing, what uh, strains they were, but um but yeah, I mean the grow went pretty smooth. Um, what probably one of my best auto grows, to be honest with you. Um, yeah, I just kept the PPMs in check and drained to waste. I was checking my runoff all the whoa, time. Whoa, whoa, whoa! I gotta cut you off. Runoff <laughs> is not even doing the justice, man. This is I would rank this probably the lowest grade out of the three, just by the look of the bud. So I put that one first. But the puff on this, man. I dry puffed it a bit there before I lit it up. You can taste the fruitiness, man. You can really get that Zittles flavor that you're getting from normal Zittles. Now, this THC, they're telling me when we check it on the fast bar. I have. Um, out of the three, I, I mean, I, I feel the same as you. Out of the three... That's probably like I'm not saying it's not good, but out of the three, that's my least favorite. Favorite, but uh, yeah, it's still it's still a banging strain though for sure. I, I don't find it as as strong as the other ones. I'm telling you right now, man, it's burning very very clean. I've tried your stuff a few different times. I've tried your stuff. Audio's gone. One sec here. Why are we losing audio? You got audio now. There we go. And we'll put ND, NID in here. We'll put nickel in. Okay. We're going to put nickel right down here in the corner. Move him in the corner. There we go, guys. We are we are good to go. Nickel, we got the grill as little's up. Keep talking, buddy. How did this grow go? Pretty good? Yeah, you know, that grow went pretty good. All three of those strains uh, grew fairly well. Um you know, I just kept the PPMs in check. Uh, I don't think I let the runoff, the PPM in my runoff, I don't think I let it go over like 1,500, 1,600. Um, I kind of do like drain to waste uh, growing, you know. I always, when I when I water the plants, I always go for about 20% runoff. And I'm always checking the PPM on that every time. And I find you just, you just keep the PPM in check and, and they'll do good, you know. So this bud, man, I'm telling you, Nickel, it is redonkulous. Guys, if you're looking at the spinach buds here right now, it's one on the far, my left, the one without the bud piece sticking out of it there, guys, the full solid nug. It is phenomenal, man. I'm liking this. I'm getting a good little buzz off this. We're about half a, half a joint in. I don't know how I'm going to smoke three full joints on this live. We might try it, Nickel. 